Um, the board earlier talked about uh, electronic content management systems that I'm very familiar with the base work with um, Wells Fargo, on the one hand, does fund uh, home preservation events. I went to one, personally handed documents to a Wells Fargo employee who was a home preservation specialist. Well, somewhere between him and the content management system, those documents disappeared. Mm -hmm. I used the HUD certified counselors at Consumer Credit Counseling. Wells Fargo donates a lot to that agency. Again, I gave them a long series of uh, documents, and they have records of those documents being submitted. Again, between them and their electronic content management system, the documents just disappeared. So I really question their sincerity. Why are they putting all this money into having documents disappear? It just, it's a nice facade, but it doesn't do anything. For the past month, I've been thinking a lot about my time at UCLA. I work for a business, a small business run by a Japanese family. One afternoon, uh, Jimmy Ito took me for a walk around a block in downtown Los Angeles, a very large block in you know, hardcore downtown Los Angeles. At the end of the, that walk, he told me, this is the block that we used to own before it was taken away from us. And I remember the look on his face really clearly. See that same look on my face. Wells Fargo sold my house without telling me. There's no excuse. There's no excuse. They have commercials now that say, let's talk. They couldn't tell me that they were going to sell my house. The basic courtesy. They have slogans on the walls in their banks about Henry Wells talking about courtesy. They didn't do that. They stole my equity. Um, and now I'm living in my 2008 Toyota Sienna, having spent all of my money fighting them and fighting the sale. There's no excuse. Just out of curiosity, yes. did you have the original loan with Wells Fargo? It was with Wachovia. 